Hi, it's Sarah, and I'm the owner of Watermark Books and Cafe, and you're watching Book Broadcast. Typically, I'm a fiction reader. Right now, I'm reading a wonderful novel by Sue Miller. It's called Monogamy. I'll talk about that more when it comes out in September. It's brilliant. When I'm finished with that, I am going to take a break from fiction because I need to read these three books. Cast is the first one. It's by Isabel Wilkerson. The subtitle is The Origins of Our Discontents. She won the Pulitzer Prize for her previous book, The Warmth of Other Suns, which was a history about the Great Migration North. Um, here we have her exploration of the caste systems that uh, control a lot of the way we live, how our societies are structured, what makes them equal or unequal, what gives privilege to some and not the other ones. And she, she examines the caste system in India, she examines the United States, and she examines Nazi Germany. And I can't wait to get my teeth into this because I know that it's going to be brilliant. All the reviews have been exceptional. The next one is called The End of Everything, Astrophysically Speaking. We know that the world started with the Big Bang, but how the universe started with the Big Bang, but how will it end? Katie Mack has been thinking about this subject since she was in college. She is now a theoretical astrophysicist who is working at North Carolina State University. This book is um, brings the idea of the end of the universe, the light years, the years, the everything into readable and digestible bits for those of us who aren't particularly scientists but want to sort of understand what's going on, where we came from and where we are going, as scary as that might be. Katie Mack, oh, those are cool. yeah, thank you very The much. End of Everything, Astrophysically Speaking. Plus this cover is brilliant, I think. Finally, True Crimes cool. and Misdemeanors, The Investigation of Donald Trump by Jeffrey Tubin. I love almost everything Jeffrey Tubin writes. He's articulate. He it has a thorough understanding of the law. And this book focuses on the Mueller report and how he spoke to lots of people that were on the team. He read the uh, report once it was out and he followed it and had some sources along the way to help describe how the Mueller report was um, investigate how the, how the whole thing was investigated, how Robert Mueller was um, expected to sort of save the universe and put in a position that was impossible for him to fulfill, and what we might see going forward. Uh, I think it's an important book to read now, and um, if you're interested in the way uh, the special investigations work, this is the book for you. Thank you.